Hello, this is Ariel Arts Intuitive, and I have a quick message for you. So this may or may not resonate, but what I have here, um, we have the Orion, or oh my gosh, Orion Light, future, Vega future, but it's really beautiful. Okay, so we have the Force of Attraction with Homing Beacon. Totally the Divine Counterpart Twin Flame. Uh, soul connections with this force of attraction, the two uh, being that magnetic attraction and this homing beacon, hearing the call. So I feel like that's definitely going on with a lot of um, even uh, new waves is they're hearing this homing beacon. Okay, connecting to the divine counterpart. And look at that. It's almost like this see this this energy is is contained over here, but this is calling it back home to itself. Right? So, and then what we have here is beautiful. We have the guardians with Gaian awakening of the promise with oneness. These four cards right here. Beautiful. We have ascension. Ooh, 17. Uh, twin flame number, the ones and the sevens. So Gaia and Awakening. This is about uh, the ascension of Gaia, the shifting that's going on. We have preparing. So there's preparing, relocation, ascension. We have guardians, shielding, defense, warning. So the guardians, uh, the protectors of the twins are assisting right now. The promise Soulmates Attraction Partnership, this trip in oneness is about unity, consciousness, oneness, balance, patience, divine masculine energy. Okay. And then on, what we have over here is the Moonstone, Mother Goddess, Black Coral, Light in the Darkness. And then on this side, we have Hematite, Spiritual Grounding, and um, I don't know how to say this one, Sugalite, Sugalite. Um, the inner child. Okay, so from this vantage point, they're being called to each other. It's there is the homing beacon that's going off, the call. We heard the call, the clarion call. Okay, that is why we are here. Twin flames to help Gaia awaken. Our energy is being lit up. We are protected. This connection is protected. It's in oneness. I feel like this is masculine energy uh, grounding this connection in the physical, spiritual grounding with hematite and the inner child with a lot of violet right in this, this area. So I feel like some inner child stuff is coming up for the masculine, some inner child uh, wounding um, that is being brought up to the surface here. It's being protected. There's she lots of shields going up right now, okay, to assist us to, to continue this awakening. And then I feel like this is a, the feminine bringing in this mother goddess energy, being the homing beacon, masculine pulling it together in the physical, some form of fashion energetically, physically, whatever it may be, and being the light in the darkness, the divine feminine being the light in the darkness, being in that mother goddess energy, embracing the mother goddess energy within herself and being the beacon to her masculine. And it's this force of attraction that is coming in. So it's very, I like this mini reading. It's very to the point, concise, and very accurate, honestly, of where, where this process is at and where we're at. There's some inner child healing. There's anchoring in the mother goddess energy, grounding it to the, to the physical. So, yeah. Just get one good close at that. Force of attraction, homing beacon. And once those two cards came out, I was like, oh, I know what this is going to be about. 
Then I got those cards and it was just so obvious, okay? This is being protected, this connection, more than ever right now. Uh, that's just what I'm getting. So thank you and hope you guys enjoy the meditation that I recently uploaded and I'm excited to start new projects. So thank you guys. Bye.